What's going on guys, Games here coming at you for a Dragon Ball discussion video today. We're going to be talking about the Grand Prix and the Omni Kings. Now, watching all this for since they first introduced the Grand Prix and uh, Zeno, I really, I, I don't know, like I really got to give my own perspective about this because... I'm gonna go ahead, go ahead and be completely honest as I say this. I don't like Zeno and I do not like the um, uh, the Grand Priest because, and it's not because oh you know like all these ones gotta be bitches and take their orders or anything like that. It is because with uh, with uh, the Omni King they act like children even though they are extremely powerful, but that is the way that they act. Now with the Grand Priest, like my main thing is with the Grand Priest is is if he's that powerful then is he really more powerful than the Omni King or the, or, or the so-called Omni King or is he really the Omni King because if you really look at certain certain little uh, gestures in the show that they're giving like everyone gives the Grand Priest more respect than they do Zeno and like it's like the Grand Priest has got to have every little say so before Zeno does or, or anything and it's like it's really uh, astounds me because it's more like the Grand Priest is in charge than uh, Zeno is and it's almost like how you would have a aristocrat right by you if you were a king and that person is basically influencing you on what to do and you're not making the decisions for yourself you're basically just going off of what this person is telling you and they have an agenda behind it now that is possibly what has come to a lot of people's mind is is the Grand Priest up to something is he evil is he is he just like is that just his personality is he just uh, you know a stuck up person that he he can be very uh, polite but also be very fierce at the same time there's been so many speculations on who he is why he is the way he is does he have a scheme is, is there something that we are not seeing now there's been so much on okay is he really a uh, an angel is he really this i mean we obviously know that he's the father of Whis and also vados and, and the other angels more than likely but the thing that really is that really want that really gets me though is i think he has more uh stability and more stature in when it comes to the other gods as well as the other angels that he's the main guy he's the main boss and zeno's just there for show like i really just think that he's the, really the backbone of of the of the head boss and i think zeno is actually just there for show and when stuff comes down yeah zeno does something but the only time we saw zeno do something is when of course future zeno destroyed the timeline from where Trunks was from. That's the only thing we really saw. And also when both Zenos were playing that uh, planet game. Now, that doesn't really show anything. Same thing with the Grand Priest. We don't know if he's shown anything. Like, honestly, I think they're all talking until they actually do something. And I think that uh, Zeno, he's actually all talking until he really does something. Same thing with the Grand Priest. Like, the Grand Priest, yes, they may be powerful, but I think the Grand Priest is actually running things than the Omni King. Because the Omni King, all he's really doing is, you, you know, like the Grand Priest, yeah, he's protecting him when, when something may cause a threat. But it's more like I think he's using him to his own advantage. Like, And, and that's the thing that's really coming to mind like we don't know for certain if if it was really Zeno that actually said oh hey I'm gonna destroy these universes eventually or if it was the Grand Priest actually saying that just because he wanted him to do that we there's no confirmation if this was actually Zeno that came up with this or if it was the Grand Priest later on throughout the time like oh hey you know uh Zeno son like you should not worry about these universes they're not worth your time they're not worth whatever like we like you know what I'm saying guys like this is this is just me like this is my thoughts this is just my theories I could be wrong I could be way off base or I could be close um again this is what I like doing I like having my thoughts because obviously anyone that has seen my reviews I do not like Zeno. I do not like uh, the Grand Priest because of just reasons. Like I just, I just don't like him. Like just, just, just something about him. I just don't like because Zeno is very annoying, and in my opinion, even though he's extremely powerful, and the Grand Priest, he just seems too stuck up to where he's acting more like the boss when actually it looks like Zeno is, and Zeno does not look like the boss, but the Grand Priest acts like the boss. So that's just my observation and what I'm getting out of it because obviously there's something there that maybe I'm just seeing or other fans are seeing or people are just 
just having their own uh, opinions or theories on. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the Grand Prix as well as Zeno. You know, do you agree with this? Do you disagree with it? Because obviously I think that the Grand Prix, he has something up his sleeve. Just don't know if it's for good or evil or he does not care about either one. That it, I could be wrong. But the thing of it is, is that again, this is my opinion. This is my theory. And I think that the Grand Prix may be up to something that no, nobody's really expecting. Not even Weiss and his siblings so nevertheless guys i hope you guys enjoy this uh theory as well as my predictions or my thoughts on the grand priest as well as the omni king so if you guys did enjoy it leave that like but leave that like on there subscribe to the channel if you're new comment down below what you thought about it if you agree disagree what your thoughts are i would love to know on that feedback as well as all my links gonna be down in the description below as normal go follow me on there You'll be able to see what I'm up to, what I post, whether it's Dragon Ball, about my life, Game Store Industries, the whole nine. So nevertheless, guys, I really hope you guys are enjoying your day and you can see all my other reviews, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.